this is Srinivas. Today I am going to explain one small program. Okay. See, this is a program to display some text on the screen. Right. See, first of all, the program Ash include Ash include stdio.h. This is an adder file. That is standard input output dot h adder file. Okay. Next uh, ash include con io dot h. This is console input output dot adder file. These two adder files in each and if every program we have to include, right? So this is ash include std io dot h. This is standard input output dot adder file, and ash include con io dot h. This is console input output dot adder file. Next, we have to start the main function with uh, open parenthesis and close parenthesis. These are called uh, parenthesis or round brackets. These are called uh, std io dot h. Within the these these brackets are called angular brackets. These are called uh, parenthesis or round brackets. After main function, we have to start with the braces, right? Means curly braces, okay? Curly braces or braces, right? Here you see CLR, SCR. This is a function which is defined in CONIO dot H console input output dot adder file. This is a function. Clear the screen, right? And every statement is terminated by semicolon. So CLR is here. After brackets, we have to keep the semicolon. Next, printf. Printf is a function which is defined stdio dot h, which is defined in stdio dot h. So the standard input output dot adder file. So what exactly the fun the function of this printf? function what is the use of this printf function is to display any text on the output screen this is printf in the within the double quotes this is my first program and uh, close the bracket and semicolon right here this is forward slash n this is a new line character okay this is an escape sequence i mean a new line character it means it will it will display every time in the new line only right for that reason we use forward slash n okay next get ch this is a function which is defined in console input output dot adder file the purpose of this get ch function is whenever if you want to see the output to screen we use this get ch function to wait uh, the data from the keyboard so for that reason we use get ch function to wait the screen to see the output right so for that reason we use get ch function okay and return zero after that finally we have to close the braces curly braces after main function we have to start the curly braces and after return we have to close the curly braces this is a small program to display a text right this is the first program in that we can learn many things right we have to include these two header files and after that we have to use main function after main function we have to stop the curly braces so this clr cr function this is every time it will clear the screen and printf is a function which is used to display a text on the screen and get ch function it will wait to see the output of the screen okay this is written zero after that we have to close the curly braces so the same program we will run now with the help of dos uh, i mean sorry turbo c software right c See the same program. See, hash include stdio dot the same program. Here, so.
also to run to compile this program c program alt f9 alt f9 c success so to run the program control f9 see this is my first program we got the output here one thing we should uh, keep in mind here i use it the clear screen if i run again control f9 again this is uh, my first program because it will it will clear the screen clr sr now i will put the comment uh, with the help of uh, two backspaces here if i keep here comment like so i am giving so the turbo c compiler will treat it as a comment it means it will not consider the statement clr sr now if i compile and run the program by pressing alt f9 and control f9 c this is my first program if i again run see every time it is displaying before we used clr sr function it means it will clear the screen now i put in the comment clr sr so it is not clearing the function means every whenever you compile or run the program automatically it will take c control f9 see it will uh, display a new line see if i remove this new line symbol new line right it means it will display in the same line so alt f9 and control f9 see in the same line it has given the second time this is my first program if i run one more time alt f9 control f9 okay see again the same line it is displaying because why we have removed the new line sequence this is this is a so this is a new this is every time whenever i run the program okay so so now so that's why it has displayed in the same line right so we have learned and if i remove this comment clr sr if i compile alt f9 and control f9 see one time it is this earlier data has been erased it means clr sr function it has executed and it will clear the screen okay so and next see here slash t t means tab c alt f9 and uh, control f9 this is my first program it has taken a uh, tab tab means it has taken uh, the space okay one tab it has taken this is my first program if i execute again control f9 see because i use it clr sr every time it is displaying so i will put in the comment clr sr now you can be able to see 